But we begin at four with what police are calling a deadly case of road rage in a traffic hotspot during the morning rush. We're now learning more about the 30 year old killed family say headed to his first day at a full time job. The shooting happened yesterday morning along busy Colonial Drive in Orlando. News Six's Catherine Silver joins us live with the new details uncovered in court documents. Catherine. This is the parking lot where police say the suspect told them that he was the one who opened fire. An arrest affidavit states that he never saw another weapon. The victim stayed inside of his car and only yelled at him. The shooter claims he felt trapped and feared he would be followed. So he grabbed his gun and shot him. Dash cam video recorded the sound of gunshots on East Colonial Drive. The moment Orlando police say Nicholas Carrasquillo shot and killed David Sly. We're required to have a pretrial detention hearing. Tuesday afternoon, the 26-year-old faced a judge on a first-degree murder charge. An arrest affidavit states Carrasquillo told officers at the scene he was the one who shot Sly, who was behind the wheel of this white Impala. He claims Sly cut him off. The two exchanged words, and when the light turned green and Sly didn't move, he grabbed his gun from the glove box. I'm reading quotes from this. It says he fired one round into the roadway and then seconds later fired more shots. And this is on Colonial. Right. Busy area. We're talking, what, 6 o'clock in the morning? We asked our own traffic safety expert about road rage incidents and aggressive driving. We see it happen, and here at News 6, it seems like we're seeing it more often. It is on the increase. Uh, I can tell you from my experience with the Florida Highway Patrol. What should drivers keep in mind just in general to avoid this from happening? It's the little traffic laws that we need to pay attention to that will ultimately make our day so much easier, whether it's making a complete stop at a red light, using your turning signals, uh, just being gracious to each other. Carrasquillo later told officers he only intended to maim the driver because he wasn't moving. The victim's uncle says Sly was on his way to work his first day full time at his job when he was killed. His family says he was a loving father who will be missed. And right now the suspect remains in custody at the Orange County Jail. He is being held without bond. For now, I'm live in Orlando. Catherine Silver, getting results, News 6. Catherine, thank you.